Uh oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck on him. Get me out. Get me out. Okay. <laughs> he <laughs> teabagged me. What the f? I just got teabagged by f Brooklyn. What? Oh, uh, that was good. That was a good intro bit there. It's getting teabagged by Brooklyn. That could be the name of the episode, too. <laughs> I don't know the words, but that was beautiful, right? That was haunting. Wow, we're oh, gonna get dangerous. a fucking copyright claim for that. Really? Like, who fucking has the rights to Ave Maria? Probably Maria. Mm, good point. All right, okay. let's go. <clears throat> intro. I guess it was like a kind of that nice musical that intro was, to start that it. That was the intro. It was a haunting remedy of Ave Maria. I feel like sometimes our intros are just getting less and less involved. Well, yeah, they can't all be gold, but I honestly think that was a good one. That, that was a good one, yeah. We needed something like... I kill that? What is that? It's a little man. Okay. Not very talkative, That's... is he? That's D's brother. Do you remember D? No. Oh, is that like a spinal cord? Oh, centipede. You don't remember D? D? Who's that? D's nuts. <laughs> no, he's actually named D though. There's a character named D. Ooh, he, like, is that has... the boss up there? Remember, he's the guy with the golden armor, and he's got like the little man. Coming yeah, out that of we, met, we met. We met him at the round time. table. Yes, that's his brother, and this is an entire quest line where, like, he dies, and, like, you get his armor, and then you can give it to that guy, and then he can help you fight this boss. I don't really know. <clears throat> but that's why you brought me here to fight Brooklyn up there? It is literally Brooklyn. You are 100% correct. I knew you would, like, be excited to fight Brooklyn, though. This boss isn't very tough, though. But I can't summon Mr. Jelly. It is a From Software game, so you know that there is, um... There's gotta be some gargoyles. There's always gargoyles. Oh. No, I think the only reason you can't summon Mr. Jelly... Ooh, is because you had summoned me. And so it was, like, still thinking, like, I might have been in that world. Ah... But I think when you restart, you'll be able to get Mr. Jelly. Even though I doubt Mr. Jelly can poison a gargoyle. Maybe. I'm not fully aware of Mr. Jelly's capabilities, but... Yeah, see, you got him. You were doing really good damage to him, but he kind of fucked you up with, like, that one hit. What was he doing? What's that supposed to be? He just, like, threw up a bit on the ground. Oh my god, he does so much. Mr. Jelly cannot handle that heat. He's fucking Whoa. just used Excalibur or something. Yeah, he did. Oh, he wrong button. Seller. Somehow that didn't hit you, though. Yeah, I don't know if you're ready for Brooklyn. It's kind of tough. Again, but like this is where you chose to bring me. You know, you don't actually have to fight this boss right now. This isn't like the. Wait, most why did path. you bring me here? I'm just giving you some like options, some flavoring. Like you can, we can go whichever way you want. This isn't the way to help Randy though. So if you I know, but back... your whole thing from earlier, like go, you gotta go this direction or that direction. Wow, my goodness. Now I should have known. I should have picked the fucking other way. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, we. if you don't beat him in a couple tries, we'll just go back there. And we'll come back to him maybe eventually. Ow. 
You get his big sword, though, when you beat him. Don't you want that big sword? Is it as big as the one I currently have? He's so fast. That's the issue I got here. It, it's not as big as the one you have. The only other reason to really come down here is just to get some cool armor. Um, fight another boss. Oh, it's you don't want to go into it. I see now. It's poison. You can kind of abuse... Oh, Mr. Jelly's done, Ski. You can kind of abuse your iframes, though. Like, just keep rolling, and he can, like, never hit you. Yeah, like, just... Anytime he's attacking, just roll. He kind of just, like, flies all over the place. That's why I'm here. I'm your coach. Oh! He didn't think he would come back on you like that. Now, I don't actually know any of the gargoyles from the show Gargoyles other than Brooklyn. Um, they were all named after parts of New York. Oh, uh, was there like Hell's Kitchen? Well, wait, wasn't there also one named Goliath though, actually, for some reason? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, maybe not. Well, there's two now, I see. Yo, you didn't seem very worried about that. And it happened. So, like I was saying, if you've played a From Software game, you know that there's always gargoyles. And you always know that there's always more than one gargoyle. That's like Miyazaki's thing. Anytime you fight a gargoyle, there's more than one. He's now, like, your whole thing way. of, like, this isn't important and I don't have to do this. I really wish you would have brought that up before I went in there with 20,000 souls. Did you lose them? I will if I don't beat this boss. Well, you think, well, you remember we got that sacrificial twig. This might be our chance to use it. Oh, I see what you mean. So next time you die, put the sacrificial twig on and then just die again and then you'll have all your souls. Probably have more than one of those. Probably. I think you could do this though. I don't think it's that tough. He just kind of does Excalibur and flops around. Sometimes he uses his big axe. Sometimes he uses his big sword. Whoa. Oh, sometimes he does some bullshit like that. I will see if he can get poisoned though. Mr. Jelly's putting in work. 9 to 5 down at the jellyfish factory. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, oh, you're also fighting, like, a big monster, and you haven't used your giant hunt at all. Oh, I kind of forgot about that. Yeah, like, stab him in his fucking dick. I think when oh, you're fighting them, moved. you can usually... You can fight them typically one at a time. Yeah, that one's a little bit more dangerous. I think. Like they don't usually interfere with each other too much. Uh oh, I'm in the poison cloud. Ah, oh, fuck. All right, we just gonna grab the souls and run then. Uh, I mean, yeah, it seems like I could probably beat him. <clears throat> we'll try a few more times. <clears throat> Do we have, like, little, like, things to, like, get rid of our poisoning? Like, little items? Or are we just gonna Man, try not to Man, I don't poisoned? know. That's beyond me. Man, Mr. Jelly's not really helping you here. No. After you've, like, had his back so many times. The whole reason I'm down here on this fucking quest is because of him. Oh, I didn't... I was not expecting that. Oh, because Randy gave him to you. Oh, that's the poison. That's the poison. It does so much damage. Oh, my God. Yeah, well, the poison itself, when you're poisoned, doesn't do a lot of damage, but his, like, acid cloud does tons of damage. You just don't want to be in it. Now you're, like, a stinky man. Uh-oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck on him. Get me out. Get me out. Okay. 
Getting teabagged by Brooklyn. That could be the name of the episode too. Fuck me. Teabagged by Brooklyn! Exclamation point! Exclamation point! Question mark. You'll and never believe what Brooklyn does to this skinny child, the skinny Lebanese boy. You. What do you have against the Lebanese? This is the second time you brought him up. I was, it's like the fifth time. He's just a tiny Lebanese person. But you did say I remember. That the only Lebanese person you've ever met was not a skinny child. Yes. Oh, fuck that. I don't even know if I could find Lebanon on the map, honestly. <sighs> Is it in Africa? It's in the Middle East. Mm. <laughs> Oof. We almost had him that one time. Mr. Jelly, you're not pulling your weight here in this one. Yeah, Jelly isn't pulling his weight here. I don't know how, how high of a level he is, though. He might need more levels. You think if I like sang some opera music it would help you? Yeah. It's like that one? Is that good? Yeah, I love it. <clears throat> uh oh, I went in it. I went in, I didn't mean to do that. You just chop the tip off that slag slag mite? Slag tight? No, it's just a the slagger. Just a slagger. Is that like a real thing? Mm hmm So like if it's not in a cave, it's a slagger? It's a it's a good old slagger then. That sounds like like what you would call like a cheap whore. The a slagger. Yeah, I've had enough slagger. of this. Filthy lot lizard. You know, you could always summon your good pal, George. I could just fucking go the way I wanted to go in the first place. Wait, wait. Get your sacrificial branch on. Yeah, I'm going to. I got two of them. Oh, you got two of them. And then don't even give him the satisfaction of killing. Just, like, jump off the waterfall. Like, say, like, something epic while you're doing it. I'll still fight him. Oh, like what if this is it this time? Like you have no nothing's holding you back anymore. You're not afraid of death. I mean that'd be. I nice. do find, I do find whenever I have souls on the ground in a boss room that um, it does like hold me back a little bit. It makes me a little bit anxious. And whenever I don't, I feel like more confident in my ability to die. I had so much confidence right there. You wouldn't fucking believe it. Oh, he got the slagger. He cut the slagger in half, and then it disappeared. All right. Do I want to go to the stake or just the side It grace? doesn't matter. You can teleport from either of them. We're just trying to go back to that original <sighs> one. All right, so we went to the right. Dan wasn't happy. He feels like his time was wasted. I feel like everyone's time was wasted. I mean, not really. We had some, we had some good bits and gaffs and goofs. You want to use your souls though before you lose them again? Oh yeah. And then we'll just go to the left this time. We're just looking for like a site of grace on the left of that like big field where all the barbarian people are. So I got a fast travel to. You definitely should be able to wear heavier armor now. You've been upping your endurance. I feel where? like you could put something. Uh. Up you here? want? No, the one up here? on the bridge. Yeah, I'm in. I think you might be able to equip something heavier now if you want. The red hood. We don't have. 
We don't have a lot of choices. Is the red hood heavier than that one? Yeah, that's why we might even be able to get like a dumb little helmet on. Yeah, look, these are all still medium loads. What is this? You might be. What is you got that? that from... You got that from the silver tier. <laughs> that you what the fuck? Um, we could probably wear a helmet, like a little. No, I, we. Helmet. Yeah, I won't wear anything where you can't see Pot's face. Well, there's the you have the ones that don't cover his face. Oh, like these? Like that, that one. That one has like a little feather on it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right, how do you nice. feel about that? You can barely I mean, just see his dopey. Do we have face. any other armor that you can put on too? Are you happy with your wizard armor? Your well, we do have that dress. Oh, nice. That actually doesn't oh, look nice. that bad. I mean, yeah, it's okay. It's worse though, isn't it? it isn't it? It is. Yeah, I just have like the heavy armor. I can't do that though. Oh, okay. All right. Well, we got like a little helmet now, I guess. Something. Eventually, we'll get more armor. Let's ride. Yeah. So we're yeah. Let's ride. We we're riding out of this field, and then we're gonna go to the left a bit, and try to find. There's a site of grace on the left. Um. And then. It's not actually that far from what we need to get. We could have, like, easily gotten it last episode and just been done. Yeah, but... if fucking, like, two episodes ago, if I just would have stopped when you said left or right, I should have thought, ooh, wait a minute. Well, Which way do I actually want to go? According, according to the Bible, like, left is the way of the devil. Right is the way of God. So, like... You did choose the right path. In yeah, the it was, and it was a mistake, so what does that say? About Jesus? Uh, yeah, I'm not. I don't know. I feel like we talk about Jesus a lot. Like, I feel you like bring, we should yeah. like, name this podcast. The Jesus I just cast? Have like, deep like, how seat, left are we talking? Like, left? Yeah, yeah, like, all the way over there. But now you're going to have this wolf down your fucking ass. No, oh, don't worry about it. Yeah, right there. I wonder if you would have found this if I wouldn't have told you where it was. Probably not. All right, we got, are you ready to do some like parkour on the roof? <sighs> yeah. This Forbidden do City doesn't really have much in the way of like safety. Well, do you see that fucking thing? You weren't even like phased by it. What? That, like giant seated skeleton. Oh, that? It's just a big statue. Or is yeah, it real? It's like a big skeleton. Well, how the fuck was I supposed to know that? It's just a statue. There's statues everywhere. It's not like it's moving. Do you remember when we first met, like, a uh, mutual acquaintance that we're both friends with? And they told us that they were big into parkour? <laughs> I think about that sometimes. I'm Who like, was what it? The fuck were they I don't remember about? what you're talking about. No? All right. I don't want to name drop. But... We we lived with him for for a couple years. Oh, him? Yeah. He, really? He was he was huge into parkour. He even had like parkour shoes and shit. And he was like, oh, like I like when I first met him. Like that's what he said to me. He's like, yeah, I'm, my name's blah blah blah, and I'm like into parkour. <laughs> I was like, what? What the fuck? I don't remember shit. that. Yeah, he had, he had like a phase. That like, where? I can you make that jump? College. You can, but I don't know if we need to go over there. <clears throat> I don't know what to tell you anymore, Dan, because if I give you directions, you just get upset at me. Well, you That's knew that I would get jump. upset at that last one you did. What is that? Did it turn into fucking mist? Oh. No, it just took turned into like a dark elf. A naked dark elf with a mate. Ooh. Not very strong, though. Ooh. Almost got me. I getting too greedy. Nice. Picking up all these fucking bits lying around. Little like little silver slimes. Yeah, what's that about? They're just ingredients. Like like the flowers that I gave you that one time. <laughs> all of your flowers? Yeah, it's alright. I never use them anyway. I'll be able to get more if I need to. There's actually supposed to be two of those mimic people there. The, like, the one you just fought. There's supposed to be two of them that 
are there together. I don't know what happened to the other one, but it wasn't there. That's a bit weird. Mm -hmm. More sad Bioshock violin. That's a big woman. I'll fight him. Now, how do you feel about Indiana Jones? <clears throat> which one? I don't know. Which one's your favorite one? I mean, the early ones I liked. You know, yeah, fuck Nazis, one. right? The most you recent mean, like, one wasn't so great. The most recent one being, like, the one that came out in, like, 2010? Like, yeah. Yeah, I don't actually remember much of that movie, but it was fairly disappointing. It's actually worth it to use your little stone thing on there. Huh? Remember? There's, like, little gargoyle doors. This one's worth it. It will be controversial, but it is worth it. Maybe. Maybe not. We'll see. Well, you have to use uh, just one. Do I have to fight this person? Yeah, I'd get rid of that prompt, though, because remember what happens. There you Which, go. Okay, yeah. These are the people that live down here. They're like... Fancy lads. Like little flowy hats. Oh. Yeah, not so fucking tough, are you? No, they're not super tough. But they were like, just mining, what? Like, worshipping this box? <clears throat> what do you got, so, buddy? So, this is considered to be the best spirit summon in the game. Maybe. Now, I know you won't use it because you have Mr. Jelly, but I figured you might want to have it just in case you decide to use it. What, does it just make another me? I don't actually know. I've never used it. I've never used it, but people seem to think it's, like, the best one, like, the most overpowered one. How do you know that if you never even used it yourself? Because I, I go on the Elden Ring subreddit and agree with what people have to say. You can slide down the ladders, you know. Yeah, I forgot. You didn't even need to take the ladder. This game's all about verticality. Person, are they gonna like do something? Oh, it's like a wizard. What the fuck? Oh, there's another one. What's up with this camera? The big ball got me? <laughs> you were so confused. You're like, what was that? Yeah, what the fuck was that? Yeah, it was the big ball. The big ball got you, man. That's why I asked you about Indiana Jones. You oh. were very aloof about that ball. The ball will chase you. That is and interesting. I was not expecting that. If you only had the lightning ram's powers, you could avoid it. I could have become a ball myself. Now, careful of this jump. Oh, there is two of them this time. I guess one of them just, like, killed themselves earlier. Fucking crossbow coward. Yeah, crossbows are your, like, biggest nemesis. Getting back to the early years of Elden Ring. Ooh. You can run past these guys, but they will chase you forever. I think if you use the Mimic Tier Summon, I think it makes one of these guys. I don't actually know, though. The good, the, I think the good thing about it, though, and why it's so popular, is because it doesn't take FP to summon. I think it uses health. I'm just collecting your silver tear husks. Mm -hmm. Like that one time when you had to collect the moss every fucking time. But now if we ever need that. Yeah, have you used the moss at all? Not yet, but whenever the time comes, I'll be ready. So I should, I guess, give you our destination. Our destination is between that woman's legs. Oh, okay. That's where we're going. This time, don't die to the big ball. 
How do I not die to it? Uh, do you want me to tell you? I have to kill There's... them both? Well, you can kill the ball, but the way to avoid the ball is if you move further into the room, there's places off to the left and right where the ball can't roll. Mm -hmm. I can't believe it snuck up on you, though, because I, I didn't hear it either. It was just kind of like very sneakily, like, sneakily coming up after you. Okay, fuck that ball up. Fuck geometry. <laughs> oh, you hit your friend! Where's the other one? The ball... There? The ball does not discriminate between... The ball's not very though. smart, though, because it's not trying to, like... <clears throat> hide or anything. It's just, like, taking a beating. I mean, yeah, it's a big ball. I think they drop larval tears, which is good. I'm still trying to figure out what those guys are gonna do eventually that's gonna like fuck me up. Um. Because so far they seem pretty weak. Yeah. But I feel like anytime there's an enemy that I'm like, oh, this fucking bitch, then it'll do something that'll be like, yep, that's what it does. Uh, they're not super strong. Well, they have this nice, like, little town they built down here that everyone loves so much, so you'd think they'd have at least something going for them. I think Look they're actually that. cursed to, like, spend eternity. Look at that guy's big fire giant shield. Mm-hmm. You could have a cool shield like that. I never will. Look at all I mean, these. Yeah. I'm not gonna. Yeah, we don't need to deal with these guys. I don't know if there's anything actually stopping you from just going into the area and just getting the thing that we want. There's a portal. Yeah. Treasure hunting has never been so easy. Yeah, I, this is it. This is the treasure of Nokron. The Finger Slayer Blade. All right, we did it. What's it look like? It's not a weapon. It's just a oh. key item. It has lore on it. Do you want to read the lore? No. I don't know where the teleporter takes you, even. Oh, that's it. We're pretty much done down here, unless we're going to go fight those gargoyles at some point. So we can get some cool armor. Oh, it just takes you back here. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Yeah, there we go. So we take that back to Rani and she'll uh, give us what we want. Oops. She'll give us the goods. She'll give us the goods, boys. Where was she at over here? Yeah. Yeah. It's a pretty now, productive one. Well, I didn't help you at all there. No, he didn't. What's up with him? He said he'd like he'd go get the trader. Yeah. You can so talk I... to the giant if you want to know where he is. No, I'm assuming he's off doing something important. I have a tired face. Pot, <laughs> he's seen, he's getting sick of it. You look like that guy from Hercules. I'll never not see that with like <laughs> the sad eyes and like this narrow face. It's the puppet. Ah, How you doing? It was the, not it was the. It Mm -hmm. Yeah, Bly didn't do shit. Sensed it. it is in thy possession, is it not? The hidden treasure of Nokron. Yep. My thanks. Finally, all the pieces are in place. No problem. Soon must I begin my journey. Upon the dark path only I may tread. Alright, see you later. No. Talk to her. She didn't give you a thing we need. Before I leave, I shall entrust thee with this. Did I need anything from her? Um, an inverted statue. Just put it the other way. I don't. My thanks for thy sterling efforts. No problem. A strange gift, perhaps, but a rare sort. So, if you were doing a different quest line, she would know that you I wanted that. Now. 
We didn't really do that quest line. But I must thank Torrent too for his Don't oh, fucking fuck thank Torrent. him. Yeah, don't thank Torrent. Alright. <laughs> That's what every girl says to me after sex. Alright, cool. So we're I'll tell you where to take that statue. But if we want to continue Randy's quest line, there's more to it, but we don't need to do it right now. We would go to the other tower um, in this area, and there would be a portal that we could take um, that would uh, take us somewhere to continue her quest line. But we no, don't I, need to do I, that I right did now. what I said I'd do. I gave her a hand. Yeah. Now I can get back to my mission of killing Elden Lords. Where's <clears> the next one at? Well, let's go get the, the, the medallion that we want, the talisman that we want. Oh, fuck. I forgot about that. Yeah, where is that? So, you see that big tower that's jutting out into the lake there? No. There's, like, a tower and there's, like, the this? bridge to another tower. No, like, into the ocean. On your into right. Into the ocean? Um, oh, this. Yeah, that's right. our objective. Yeah, we gotta go through the bottom part, though, which is the one closer to the land. Like, yeah, right here? There. Yeah, we go through there. Perfect. That's the way we need to go. Uh, yeah, so you don't want to help Ranny anymore? You're done? I mean, I got no reason to. We could... If we ever feel like going back and doing her other bits, when you go to the other tower, you can get her clothes. If you want, if you want to wear her That's outfit. a bit creepy. Yeah. You also get, like, a tiny little sex doll of her. Yeah, again, like, I don't know. We don't really have that kind of relationship. It's just kind of like a friendly one. She gave me Mr. Jelly. I beat up her mom, and then I found a <laughs> fucking treasure for her. You did beat up her mom. A big fucking tree. I'm getting sick of it. Seems like Are everywhere you look, tree? it's growing. I mean, it is kind of like the, the 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 central like point of the game. I'm gonna Third fucking tree. chop it down. Wow, that's blasphemy. I yeah, that's kind of man pot is. I will fuck that tree up. No regrets. Fuck trees up. No, okay. if that if that ever becomes an option in this game, I promise you, I'll take it because I'm just sick of looking at it. You're going to love the Volcano Manor when you go there, because those people are all about, like, just fucking... Fuck the Erd Tree, let's just kill everybody and get on with it. Well, I don't need to kill everyone, but I'm just sick of that tree. How you doing, ghosty? Yeah, the princess. So, if you come here before we have the statue, you would go... Yeah, so this, that's where the statue goes. If you come here before you have the statue, there's just, like, this fucking annoying wizard cunt that shoots a magic bow at you, and it's really annoying. Um, but you'll also have to fight them when it's inverted. I don't understand why the statue is upside down, but you could just flip it the other way. Well, because it makes the tower upside down. You know, it's like a fantasy key. all about the moon baby okay because you're, you're going to be going into the tower it's upside down now the layout is different this is honestly down I'm warning you is going to be fucking annoying the wizard count with the bow is very annoying and it sucks so that's an elevator you would take up normally but now we're dropping down Hand creeping up there. Yeah, I hate these fucking hands. There's one on that side too, but I don't know how to. Ow. Are you ready to just fucking hate life? Mm hmm. You haven't met this fucking wizard yet. They're there now. How do I get to him? Oh my god. I gotta go the other way. 
No, you have to go that way. You just run and like drop. I'm not, I'm I... gonna just direct you through this because like I can't be bothered to be like here any longer, even though I'm not even playing. You will just yeah, direct just keep... me through. Just run to the left there, and then you'll be able to drop down to where she can't shoot you. You can just run past these fuckers. Left. Grab your souls. Keep going. Drop down here. Oh! Got a new helmet, but it covers your face, so we can't use it. Um, so from here, I think we want to go... She's in that middle bit. There's some hands and some ghost soldiers. I think we want to go to the uh, caddy corner, the opposite side. Oh, she's coming. Jesse, she's coming! Oh! Whoa! Oh. What's she doing? She was like flying around. Oh, this is like a hit right yeah. here. Don't let up. Don't let up. Nope. Oh, fuck. Oh. Can't believe she didn't roll off the side there. I know, it's like the game She's won't let it happen. fucking beating you up with her fucking <laughs> The game hand. won't let it happen. What the fuck? Okay, she teleported. Good. I actually worked out in our favor because if you fight her up here, there's a bunch of bullshit. Where'd they? Go? Where'd she go? She she teleported down below, like on the other side. Oh, so I can go um, up. Take this slow. Cause she can't. She, yeah, yeah. So do you see over on the other side? There's that ramp leading down. Who's this? It's just a ghost soldier. She's down there, though. Do you see her? Oh yeah, yeah. Oh god, please. We don't need to go this way. Oh. I don't think it connects. But these things give you like free somber smithing stones. What the fuck? Oh, it's that soldier. He's throwing like his little rocks. Big shield man. This two guys. The greatest gonna... nemesis. Right? What? Oh. If you die of this thing after surviving against that wizard, I'm gonna be so upset. I can't beat it! He's not that tough. Just break his guard. There you go. Oh, people with those big shields. Fuck me. Where am All I? Right, so, we're going to the right here. Oh, she's like climbed up a bit. See, we're going towards her where she's at. We can drop down there. Oh, man. I just. Uh, oh, like right down there? Yeah, it seemed to work, though, when you just rushed her and beat the shit out of her. She's pretty tough, though. And if she hits you with that bow, it's a big dumb on you. You try to like bait her to come into you so you can like yeah. jump on her. Yeah. I don't think she, I don't think she'll do it. But you took off a lot of her health before she teleported. Nice. Oh my god. Hmm. If you had one shot, one opportunity. Nice. Oh, that's I, the good. game doesn't let her roll off the. Ah! Secret hands. Don't panic. Yes! Good job. Can I I wanna point out the game doesn't let her roll off the edge. Did you see that yeah. shit? That's yeah. hardly fair. I agree. <sighs> and it took me like ten tries to do this, so I'm proud of you. You did it first try. That's a second try. Second try. Oh, you didn't really know what was going on the first time. All right, I think we want to drop onto the chandeliers. Aw, oh, ghost boys. I don't think she responds, though. So, like, if you die here, you just have to, like, go down here. Well, you can't go past I'm thing. stuck on these fucking... On the oh, geometry. No. Got me in that corner. <laughs> geometry. The geometry. Think about it, Dan. At the end of this path are two twin great swords. And you will you will never want for another weapon. I thought I wanted my big sword. Well, isn't that the goal is to use the two oh, big ones? Oh, I see what you mean. To get the thing to use that, you mean. Yes. That fucking it knocked oh my god. Oh no, 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 no. Do not let the fingers finger you. I 
I feel like there's not like many like grosser concepts just like with words than fingering. Like fingering is like such a foul like way to put like <laughs> you know like I'm I, I'm just not appealing like oh I'm gonna go fingered you know like let's get fingered yeah yeah it's it just not like a really nice turn of phrase no it's not great I guess I don't like fighting here yeah the geometry I think we just need to drop down to the what to there I guess. Yeah, I think so. Alright, now we just need to traverse this bit. <laughs> this dangerous um, bit. Mm-hmm, looks dangerous. I think we just need to get to that middle bit, though, with the stairs. If you come here the other way around, there's a bunch of fucking rats up here, and it sucks. That's garbage. All right, I think we did it. No, I just stand on that thing. Oh. Upside down elevator. Ooh, spooky. Yeah, it's a little bit weird. Open up, bitches! I don't know why there's a cutscene here. I think you're just opening a door. It's a it's a big door though. I guess it needs to be dramatic. It's cold yeah, outside. You're like How big paradigm. was this tower that I made it to a fucking different climate? It's always rainy on these like bridges to these towers. We've done this before. I don't know, it's fine. It's just raining a little oh, bit. Oh, I see. Alright, I think we can ride our horse here too. So we can just speed on over to the other side. Uh oh, we can even get a cheeky level here. How far are you going to bump endurance? We don't even Probably. have any armor we can wear. Probably not wear. anymore. Well, I, I want it to be up enough so I don't have to use the talisman that lets me wear my current armor. You know what I mean? Oh, I see. Because I'll have to use the talisman to increase my intelligence. What's this guy? Big thing. These things are so fucking annoying. These are like my least favorite enemies in the game. I'm surprised. I thought this was a boss, but I guess he's just an enemy you fight here. They're, they're fucking so annoying. I actually didn't even try to fight him on tour. He's wearing the skin of like other people. And like the skin of gods, maybe? They're called god skin nobles. And you're fucking them up. I mean, I think being on Torrent really makes this easier than it would have been without him. <laughs> I guess so. Yeah, I don't think he's hit you as a good one. Uh oh. Huh. I oh, like this how... Is... Oh. This is good. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now, the amusing part about this enemy is that they're kind of a big blubbery little man here, but they're so finessey with their little rapier. Mm-hmm. Like they're a fancy lad. I don't think they themselves are actually big. I think they're just wearing like a big fat suit. Like if you look at his arms and his like face, I don't think he's that big. He's got a tail though. And they do have weird little lizard tails. Yeah, we just don't want to get run into him whenever he's rolling around. Mm -hmm. Like a pancake on its side. Like a very thick IHOP pancake. 
And I don't think I've ever had a good eating experience at the IHOP. Now, what do you consider, like, how good is in what? I mean, I've been to an IHOP before, and it's just kind of like, I mean, it's not good food, really. Well, I don't like breakfast food. And so oh, if you don't right. get breakfast food at the IHOP, you're kind of shit out of luck, because their normal yeah. food is so fucking gross. That, like, so I have to get breakfast food typically, but it's just, like, never, like, made me, like, happy. But when I think back, like, have you ever uh -oh. eaten at a King's? Had, like, King's breakfast? Like, King's chocolate chip pancakes? No. I fuck with those. Oh, this is bad. I don't even know how you can avoid this on the horse. <laughs> Just keep riding. Just ride away. <laughs> he can't hit you if you can't see him. Oof. It's close. Oh, God. Uh, this man's gonna chase you in your dreams tonight. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, what's his hallway. fucking deal? He just wants your skin. Ooh. He wants to wear your skin. Why does he want mine in particular? He wants to wear your skin to his birthday party. I mean, as long as he just doesn't do that like big rolly bit, I think you should be good. He can't seem to track you with his rapier when you're riding past. Oh, here it is. That didn't hurt you. Fuck. Couldn't even get fuck. up. Oh, fuck. This fucking game sometimes. Well, that's what happens when Torrent drops you, right? You just <sighs> fucked. And that's why, kids, remember to fuck Torrent. Yeah, why it's did Rainy rain thank Torrent, people. of all things? Torrent, you fucking suck. I hate you so much, you stupid fucking shit horse. Oh. Yeah. He was not happy you said that, Jesse. <laughs> the revenge of Torrent. Straight up. I don't know if you need to fight this guy. Like, you could maybe just run right past him. I mean, that's what we do when we, like, encounter a problem we can't deal with. We just, like, run I right mean, past him. I mean, yeah, it seems like it's gonna take me a while. This episode's getting to the point where it needs to end. Well, can we open it? Oh, okay, we're good. Yeah, we don't even need to fight that guy. <laughs> he's so far away, he's like, hey, hey, get back here, you little bitch. Come back here and fight me like a man. And you're like, nope. I just need my little talisman. I just need my talisman. That's what we're doing here. Ave Maria. I don't know the next line, that's the problem. It's just Ave Maria, you just continuously. <laughs> I don't think it is. Mm -hmm. I don't, they just do I don't that for like 35 it. minutes. <laughs> just, 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 that's God, what they did God. in the version I saw. Really? Are you being serious or are you just fucking... Mm -hmm. they, just, they just kept going. They just kept ave and... If they just kept ave -ing. Ave's got an ave. Mm -hmm. All my homies love Ave Maria. You can see all the places you've been, all the castles that you own. That's not very good weather for that. So this is Rainy's body. And you just chopped it. This is her actual body. Why is it always a corpse? Yay. What's she doing up here? Well... So the lore is, um, remember how she's the one that pulled out the curse of death or whatever, like has the curse of death uh -huh. and it made it so that gods can die. I think she either felt bad about that or something and she just came up here and like used it on herself, I think, and killed herself. But she didn't really because she's still like hanging out as a puppet. Well, yeah, she's a homunculus or whatever, not homunculus, uh, puppet. I actually don't know. My my lore is not on today. 
You look, you can see all your castles though. There's Magic Pot Castle, Magic King. There's mm -hmm. Pot Castle number one. Where's that? It was on the other side. It was the first one you looked at. Oh. <clears throat> Pot Castle but, two is too far away to see from here, certainly. Yeah, I don't think we can see Pot Castle two, but we can see the volcano mountain that we're trying to go to. There's someone there to and, fight. Um, it's kind I think it's of, just been a long time since I've killed an Elden Lord. That's the capital city there. That's where we're going. Um, yeah, I guess we can talk about what we're going to do next. We can maybe do the Volcano Manor next. We can maybe just go to the capital. The capital is huge, though. The capital is absolutely massive. Um, so we'll see. Now, one, uh, yeah, next now, time we'll get back to Pot's mission. We finished Ray's well, bit. I think we should finish this by equipping our, our, our awesome swords now and doing the special move on them. Because you're going to like it. Yeah, see if we can uh, go without that, that thing now. No, heavy load. Where's the one? Where is the one that does intelligence? Right be below you. Let's see. What we what do we got to do here? Still heavy load. Still heavy, Fuck. Huh? Maybe Let's we can have no helmet. miracle thing. Oh, wait. Does this weigh less or more? Well, this weighs less. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, sweet. You look so dumb. Oh, nice. Oh, Are my you ready goodness. For this? Yes. Now you gotta use the special on it. You gotta you tap it and then tap it again. Oh, wait, what? Oh, it. baby. It sucks enemies in. It has a very far range. It will suck them in from very far away. And then you, like, that big smash does tons of fucking damage. We're gonna have to level it up though with somber smithing stones, but oh yeah, I'm fucking ready though. Look He's at this giant, fucking dumb swords. thing. Bop him. That smash does so much damage, but you can only use it twice. We might need to start carrying like a blue flask just so you can do it a little bit more. All right, this is right. the new pot. Pot's upgraded. So Pots dramatic upgraded. now. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess we'll see you next time. We haven't decided what we're doing. We're probably gonna do. We'll see. We will. We'll. We'll find an Elden Lord eventually. There's Elliot. not that many left, though. I just want power. Yeah. You shall have it, young pot. Thank you. You're you're so close to your goals. All right, yeah, goodbye. Bye.